had to catch my breath. My favorite hairstyle. I will say I very much dislike the mullet. One night, a king and a queen went into a castle. No one else went in the castle. No one else came out of the castle. But three people exited the castle. Who was the third person? Well, you had the king, the queen, and the knight. <laughs>
advice would you give your students as they move on? I would want them to remember to be kind and to always do their best. So the advice that I would give is you have to reach for the stars. I know that sounds cheesy, I know that's cliche, but at the same time you have you have to determine what you want in life and you have to go get it. I think uh, the Florida Atlantic like Final Four run and having the watch party and just all the excitement that we had here at school for one of our alumni, I think that's that was pretty special and that's really gonna stand out, I think. I would give any student the advice to always work hard, always do your best. Always do your best. Um, this last week when we had the dodgeball tournament, I really enjoyed that. I like seeing the competition between each other and just having a lot of fun together. A memory from this year. I mean, the dodgeball tournament on Friday was pretty memorable. So that was pretty great. Um, but also I think just like having a normal year after being so weird for the last several years, I think that'll, that'll stand out like finally having a good year. My favorite memory, oh my gosh, there's so many, there's so many. Um, probably when we, the, one of the funniest things that happened this year was when I did try to be sneaky and pie Miss Clary and then I fell. Is there anything you'd like to tell your students? I think for me, uh, the two things are, uh, if you ever need anything at all, uh, no matter uh, you know, my relationship with you in general, uh, if you know me that well or not, maybe I've had to discipline you, it doesn't matter. I'm always here for you. Our office is always here for you. And uh, the second thing would be, um, it's all about the company you keep. Make sure you surround yourself with, uh, with good people, with good hearts that have your best interest in mind, and kind of go from there. All right, what advice would you give to your students at the Oh my gosh, where do I start? Um, don't be dumb. Okay, make smart choices. Um, go around, go around, go around. Um, let's see. My boys stay out of trouble. My girls make sure the boys stay out of trouble. Hi everybody, I hope you have a good summer. Uh, I know seventh grade has had a great year. They've worked really hard. So you guys deserve some time off. So rest up and be ready for the fall when we see you then. Okay. What advice would you give your students uh, as they move on? As they move on, life's gonna get harder. Uh, you're on battles of adversity, and you're just going to have to um, take each day one day at a time and just push through it. Finally getting my homeroom kids under control. That has to be the one. I've got some great kids in there that they're all over the place. Getting them to settle, finally. It took almost a whole semester. That was great. Probably the dodgeball tournament when I ran everybody off the court. I love them all dearly. I'm very happy that they're moving on. Um, I will miss a great number of them, um, and then I'm just happy for them. Make it through by skinning your teeth and enjoy summer while it lasts. Enjoy the ride while you advice. can. I mean, that's a pretty good one. Isn't it? Doing it right now? Yeah. Why not? What would you say? You're not going to give me a no. Head no heads up. Oh man. Uh, you got a lot of, like be safe. Yeah, but like, what would you say to him? What, what's, what would you say to what you've ever seen again? <laughs> You're awesome. Oh, You're doing great. Yeah. You're doing great. Uh, live life, enjoy it, but uh, handle your responsibilities. What's one memory that sticks with you this year? Oh, man. I have a lot of memories of uh, different students, uh, but I think one of my favorites was probably the uh, Mrs. Alt. Uh, dancing on the sidelines of the dodgeball tournament on uh, uh, Friday. That made me giggle in the best way. That was a lot of fun. Students, we've come a long way. We've learned a lot this year. Um, I hope that you have a great summer and see you next year. Don't forget to come by and say hi. Well, eighth grade, here we are. I hope you have an amazing summer. It has been an honor to be your science teacher this year. I, I am completely flabbergasted with the amount of love that I feel for you guys. I will cry. I will think of you often. I will, um, when I'm doing my teaching next year, I'll be picturing you guys sitting here whining and complaining about whatever it is we're doing. So uh, be safe, be amazing, and um, 
That's about it, really. Yeah, yeah. Make sure you guys have a wonderful summer. You stay safe, and you better come back and give me hugs when you return. I don't know. I don't really have one yet. Oh, I'm looking forward to DC. I'm really looking forward to DC trip with the graders. That's one. It's not memory yet, but I'm, that's one memory I know is going to be etched in my mind after after I go there. Um, that they're capable to push themselves and to stay organized. Keep working hard and don't get lazy. <laughs> Have a great summer. We'll miss you guys. We love you guys. Choose to be around people that are kind. Not just kind to you, not just kind to people that they like, but uh, kind to everyone. Because when you find kind people, you'll become a kind yourself. I would like to tell them how proud I am of them, and how hard they've worked, and they've overcome so many obstacles this year, and that I wish them luck for sixth grade. Have fun while you're young. Get involved in a lot of activities, sports, or like clubs and things like that after school and uh, take your school seriously because you're gonna be out of school before you know it, and then you're gonna to want to go to college or, or get a job, and they're gonna to look to see what kind of grades you made. Hope they have a good summer, and remember everything I taught you in fifth grade about social studies. Take yeah, you should always take the time to listen to music and enjoy music. Hey, have a great <laughs> summer. Eat lots of ice cream this summer. Um, I have a two things of advice. Never, never, never trip over second graders. And second thing, sunscreen, and live each day to the fullest. And after knowing so many of you for this year, please stop believing everything you see on TikTok. Please. And listen to Taylor Swift. Yes. <laughs> Study during the summer. Read something and stay busy. Do your best. Work hard. If you do that, most teachers will help you. Well, I would say that um, if you take any art classes, just be prepared to have a lot of fun. Get well rested, come back, ready to learn next year. We love you, we're gonna miss you, have a good one.